really <coughs> didn't really know Ted except by reputation. I met him once and uh, at one of these uh, earlier Vista community meetings. And uh, John, I have to say, when you were out here talking, you know, you look just like your dad. <laughs> so, um, anyway, I just wanted to talk about, I'm a, I'm a newbie in the Vista world. So uh, I've only been around Vista for the last uh, 10 years or so. And um, I wanted to basically talk about uh, my epiphany, if it, as, it, as it were. And in um, September of 2001, I was at the um, Open Source Healthcare Alliance Conference in London. And I was at a, a session on the, the second day of the conference, the last session. And um, the room was kind of crowded. There was an audience, there was a screen. And I sort of had an overflow chair sitting out on one side. So I was actually sitting at right angles where I could see the screen and I could see the, the audience. And I think about... Um, 40% or so of the audience were, were doctors. And there were these two VA employees that had come all the way to London on their own nickel, and that is uh, Chris Richardson and, and Rick Marshall. And now that they're both uh, retired from the VA, I guess um, you know, I can name names to protect the innocent. <laughs> but uh, anyway, they'd come there on, you know, spending their own money. And they talked about Vista, and at the end of it, they. Uh, they showed a, um, a video, which I think was um, one of Dr. Fletcher's um, demo videos. And, you know, and, and, and at the end of it, there was just absolute silence in the room, just total and complete silence. And, you know, this is the, the last session of the last day of the conference, and normally, you know, when, when people stop speaking, the audience starts, you know, whispering and making noise and so on. But there was like absolute pin drop silence for about 20 seconds, which is an eternity. And I looked at the audience, and many of them had their jaws sort of hanging open and looking like this. And the first words out of anyone's mouth, and I still remember that clearly, was, that's exactly what I want. Now, by training, I'm, I'm an engineer and a geek. And, uh, you know, and I'm a, a software professional. So, so to me, you know, as, as a software professional, you know, we, we don't really you know, write software for our own use. I mean, we do that too, but we really write software for other people to use. And when someone sees you know, users of a software, see a demo of the software, and, and you get this sort of reaction from them, well, that you know, was my epiphany, and it was sort of a visceral reaction you know, on my part, which said, this is exactly the kind of software that, that I should be involved in. And so I sort of got into that, and then, you know, later on when, uh, when World Vista was founded, um, you know, I was one of the guilty people that sort of, um, you know, went in and was one of the partners in crime there. But anyway, that's how I got into Vista. And... Uh, it had a, um, a personal impact on me, and it had this kind of impact on the, the users. So, thanks. <laughs>